listening to the Reject Nation. I'm Tara Erickson, joined by my close dear personal friend. Oh, Say your name. I'm John. Oh, what's your last name, John? It's, it's Humphrey. Oh, right. I, I forgot. I didn't really forget. I just wanted him to say it. Listen, guys, we're watching the Maze Runner from 2014. Ah. That's from a long time ago. Yeah, almost 10 years. I did not read the book, I don't think. Uh, if I did, I cannot remember it. But we're going to watch it, and it's going to be fun. So you guys need to leave a like. You know what to do. You need to get on the computer, type the words, leave a comment. And then you also have to subscribe. And by doing that, you can ring the bell. Ring the bell. Yes. Also, thanks to Prepper for editing down this reaction video. And don't forget, if you're not already a patron, you should become one. Because if you are, then you can sync up with your own copy and watch a full-length reaction with me and John. Like, the whole thing. Oh. Where we're sitting, we're reacting, we're doing stuff. You can watch it with us. With your own very full-length copy. And then also, we call you super sexy when you become a patron. True, so Just so you know. Sister. Yeah. You're so sexy. Also, Greg and John cover several shows exclusively over there with highlights and watch alongs included. So, like, get on the juice. Come on now, get on the juice, okay? Just do it because I told you to. And I think that's it. Should we just, like, watch it? Let's just watch it. Okay, man, let's do it. <laughs> Where are we going? Uh, are we going down or up? Oh. Uh. Uh. He is not feeling well. Is that Dylan O'Brien? Hey, that's a guy from Love and Monsters. <gasps> Ooh, and there's a monster. This is how every one of my days begins. <laughs> Day one, Greeny. Rise and shot. Will Poulter. Oh, whoa. We got a runner! A maze runner, <laughs> mayhaps. Still trying to figure out what the F is going on. Oh, okay. It's their first day at an all-boys high school. He's stuck. Okay. Was that like the version of hazing? That was their version of hazing. Yeah. They're like, throw him in that elevator with that bear. We're going to put you in a spooky elevator. Yeah. My name is Albie. Now, can you tell me anything about yourself, who you are, where you came from? Albie, the racist dragon. <laughs> Why can't I remember anything? It's okay. It happens to us all. You get your name back in a day or two. What? It's a powerful anesthetic. We grow our own food. We build our own shelter. Whatever we need. The box provides. The, the box. box provides. That big old box. We send them once a month with fresh supplies and a new greenie. By who, though? Who put us here? Yeah, now we don't know. Green bean, meet Oh, me. I love him. When I'm not around, he's in charge. This is spinach. <laughs> the boy from Love Actually is so grown up now. And I think he's on Game of Thrones, too, to be fair. Oh, yeah. Jojen something. What's out there? Never. Go beyond those walls. Do you understand me, greenie? Yes, carrots. What happens behind the walls? Everybody wants to know. Hey, Chuck. Where you been, man? Aw. You're doing better than I did. I clunked my pants three times before oh. they got me out of the pit. <laughs> Excellent. Nice. These are those same pants. <laughs> Haven't been washed. Where are you going? I just want to see. You can look around all you want, but you better not go out there. Just know what I'm told. I'm not supposed to leave. Where's your sense of adventure, Chuck? He pooped his pants too many times. He doesn't have adventures anymore. <laughs> New Greeny, huh? How's it feel to be promoted? Hey, they were just for outside. Break, breaking rules. They're different. They're runners. They know more about the maze than anyone. What? You just said maze. Wait, I, I did? Oh, Chuck. Oh, you done messed up now, Chuck. Chuck doesn't have a vault. Why won't you tell me what's out there? I'm trying to protect you, man. For your own good. Sir, you guys can't just keep me here. I can't let you leave. Why not? He's doing the Chris Pratt hand. <laughs> Stay where you are, Blue. Oh, what? Uh, awesome. I would like to go out now. This is pretty intriguing so far, yeah. I gotta say. It's a metaphor. <laughs> Crushed by circumstance. Welcome to the Glade. 
The Glade or the Blade? I still don't know what they're saying. No, they're interchangeable. <laughs> sure, there are plenty of blades in the Glade. All right, bonfires. Where did you get that cow head or horse head or whatever that is? The skull. We're trapped here, aren't we? For the moment. Those are the runners. And that guy in the middle there, that's Mina. The coolest one. <laughs> they run the maze, memorizing it, trying to find a way out. How long have they been looking? Three years. Oh, my Ooh. God. That's too long. <gasps> but yeah? what's the sound? It's the maze. Changing. Oh. Uh. This is some sick psycho ward. They're all watching you. Yeah, you're all lab rats. The runners are the only ones that really know what's out there. And it's a good thing, too, because if they don't make it back before those doors close, then they're stuck out there for the night. How many of you lost? No one's ever survived the night in the maze. Oh, but you will. You got this, Dylan O'Brien. Yeah, man. You're the greenie they never saw coming. What happens to them? Well, we call them grievers. Of course, no one's ever seen one and lived to tell about it. Grievers. Good YA novel terminology. <laughs> No, no one wants to be a runner. And besides, you got to get chosen. Get chosen by who? <laughs> the jerk guy you don't like. Now fight and show you're worthy. What do you say, Greeny? Want to see what you're made of? Yes. Greeny, Greeny. Greeny, 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 Greeny. The rules are simple, Greeny. I try to piss you out of the circle. You try to last more than five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Oh. Howie. Uh, he's not doing so hot. What do you want to be called? Shank? <laughs> oh, you are too funny, man. <laughs> I think I've settled on Shank. <laughs> Better than Radish, that's what yeah, I call it. Yeah, get him. Oh, oh, oh boy. Nice. Now you've done it. You've upset the structure. Oh. You've upset the hierarchy, man. Thomas. What? Oh, that's my name. I remember my name. I'm Thomas. <laughs> Thomas! <laughs> Thomas! <laughs> All right. Tommy boy. Oh, never seen that either. <laughs> I do love how every single YA novel adaptation does have like a sequence where they take a break to dump all the new terminology on you. Yeah. <laughs> These guys are called the this and those are called the that. Yeah. <laughs> Dang. Oh, that's spooky. We lost a lot of boys to fear, to panic. We've come far since then. Establish order. Why are you telling me this? Because you're not like the others. And the audience needs to know that. <laughs> you're curious. He was there for five, like five minutes. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Okay. Poor George. Did anyone try climbing to the top? Yes. Anything that you think of, we've already tried. The only way out here is through the maze. Now look, you want to be helpful? Yes, obviously. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Take us up some more fertilizer. It's a late reflex on that catch. <laughs> <laughs> what do we got? Bones? Oh. Grave. Mm. Damn. Damn. They did not bury that body very well. And George must not have died in the maze. Oh. 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 You're looking so good, buddy. Ben, right? I don't know if we uh, ever... What the... Oh, my God. What? Are you okay? What? <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, my gosh. Jeez. You did that. I saw you. <laughs> Your fault. What? What? <laughs> That's right, that's right. Yep. Ow. Yes. Oh, nope. Oh, oh, my God. Whoa. Some heavy stunts in this Dang. movie. 
Not going to lie, this is kind of going hard. Yeah, definitely help. What the fudge? Oh, my goodness. Wow. <gasps> What the hell happened? He just attacked me. Okay. Right, lift this shirt. I didn't need it. Lift this shirt. Look oh. at his eyes. No. What? Oh. Yeah. Stung by a in griever. In contact with a griever. He's been stung in the middle of the day. We got to put him down. Put him in a pit. Come on, everybody help. Put no. him to the pit. No. No. Ben, Jack, no. Please. 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 Some of the other people <laughs> on the blade. <laughs> Just hanging out in the field all day shooting. He said he saw me. You know, this is all my fault. How could this be my fault? Let's get some rest. What do you know? Oh. Just please listen to me. Please, me no. Cheeps, man. Sorry, dude. That's hardcore. <laughs> Sheeps. Oh. oh god, yeah. They're just gonna like send him out. Oh no, please, please don't, please don't do it. Oh. You're gonna become one of them, buddy. You gotta go. Oh, they're gonna have to push him with those tea sticks. Yeah. Oh, oh yep, here we go. Jeez, man. Awkward. Just run, buddy. Just go. Just accept your fate. Get out of there. You don't want to be squished to death. Yeah, you're going to get smushed. Come on, run. Oh, what are you doing? Gnarly. Oh, my God. Oh, he, okay, so he accepted smushing as his fate, or, uh... Well, he just didn't want to get he's smushed. Right, he's going to okay. take his chances with the maze. He's right there, okay. He doesn't want to get soft-fived right now. You think he might make it? He dead. <laughs> no one survives a night in the maze. You don't know that, man. Yeah, you haven't been out there, Chuck. Oh, oh here we go. Another dreamy or a memory? Oh, a memory. A lady. Is that... Wicked is good. Oh. Many ladies. Don't make it easy on them. Everything's going to change. Oh, for a second, I thought that was Kirsten Stewart. It's not. I thought it was um the one from Get Out to and Megan or Kate Mara. She looks like a bunch of people. <laughs> you have to choose. What do they put in your jeans, man? They give you some kind of griever repellent juju. Volunteer as tribute. <laughs> right, but why would Albie go into the maze? Albie went to retrace Ben's footsteps before sundown. So he's gonna go back to where Ben was just stung? Albie knows what he's doing. He knows better than any of us. Until he doesn't come back tonight. Every month, the box sends up a new arrival. But someone had to be first, right? Is Albie first? That was Albie. Oh. His name begins with A. Yeah. This is the future the feminists want. <laughs> so all the men in one compound <laughs> can't leave... <laughs> Monsters outside. They should be back by now. What happens if they don't make it? They're gonna make it. This is what they do. It's part of the show. Right at the last minute. Or they won't. And you guys will be worried all night. Are they dead or not? Guys, can't we send someone after them? That's against the rules. Can't risk losing anyone else. Whoa. I mean, you're kind of risking losing all of you by standing at the mouth, but... Yeah... They're gonna come around at the last second. Here we come go. On. Somebody's injured. Oh no. Okay, hurry Help it me. up. Oh god. This is a close call. No. Oh, uh, leave him. I mean, go in, uh, Dylan O'Brien. Uh, I think you have to leave him. It's all up He's to you, gonna man. help him. It's all up to you. That greenie's gonna do it. Yeah. Ooh, I'm so geez. scared. Oh my it's god, there's intense. no way. How are you gonna Oh it closed? Oh dang. Oh, oh snap. Oh my goodness. What are they gonna do? What happened to him? What does it look like? 
I can't tell. Oh, okay. He's a griever now. All right, help me get him up. We gotta go. The maze is already changing. We can't just leave him here. The old rules don't apply, Green Bee. I mean, he's dead, so take his vest pack and get going. We gotta go. Wait, 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 wait. What are you talking about? We gotta do something. We gotta hide. Where? I don't know. Just you just think. You tell me that there's not a single place we can take him? <sighs> take a look around. There's nowhere to go. <laughs> Well, I feel like there's a lot of hallways in a maze around you. You could just try something. Cover him up with the vines? Or what are we thinking? Or climb. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I still think it was a really bad choice not taking his vest off him and using his weapons. Yeah, a little bit. Like, but if he wakes up, he'll need to defend himself whilst <laughs> mortally wounded. What are you doing? Oh, just a little more and we'll tie it off. Ooh. Sorry, <laughs> What the? F hmm. All right, buddy. Leave him in a oh. lurch. Yeah. He knows the maze. Yeah. He has got time for this green bean bullshit. Oh, is he just going to, like, all right, camouflage up in there? Oh, what is this Whoa. thing? <gasps> is it what? organic or mechanical? Yeah, it looks metal to me. Heavy metal. I mean, the soundscape alone in here is quite jarring. Yeah. <laughs> be very freaked oh. out in here. Oh. Oh, oh no. spooky. Is it like a spider? Yeah, it looks like a robo spider. Ugh. Oh no. Ah, Damn. No. Oh, oh my god. Oh, gross. That looks like a Harry Potter spider. Yeah. Oh. No. Ooh. Nice swooping camera movements. Wowie. Oh, oh, oh my god. Come on, boy. It, it, oh, whoa. Whoa, nice jump. Oh. How does this work? Leaps. Leap of faith. Oh. oh no. Oh, oh. Damn. Oh. oh. Did the same people like oh. engineer these creatures? Oh, nice. You could be the first two to make it back. This thing is close. Come on, we can lose it down here. Oh, uh, nope. He doesn't like that. Trust your instincts. What are you waiting for? Get out of there! Oh, yeah, what if he, like, I was thinking that. Like, what if he just stays in there and then crushes the spider, but he gets out right on time? Yeah. Yeah, smart. That's what. Oh, God. Don't look back! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Good, 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 good. Come on, buddy. We oh. got this. No way. Yeah! <laughs> huh. This is just like yesterday. You saw a griever. You didn't just see it. You killed it. Whoa. My man. Oh, Greeny. King Greenbean. Yeah. For three years. We have coexisted with these things. And now, you've killed one of them. Did you call it coexisting? He has to be punished. What? You don't even know if you're going to get backlash for the spider dying yet, buddy. When I turned tail and ran, this dumb shank stood behind to help Albie. Look, I don't know if he's brave or stupid. Yes. <laughs> Both. Whatever it is, we need more of it. 
<laughs> I say we make him a runner. Yeah. <laughs> now we're talking. It's a subtle version of one of my favorite tropes. <laughs> we need more around that, like that around here. You're hired. <laughs> but if there is one thing that I know about the maze, it is that you do not. It's Ooh. moving at a different time, right? Everything's changing, man. Okay, wait, wait. You know that sound. Fox, it's coming back up. It should have been. Uh-oh. Just jump right in. It's a girl. What? Oh. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. This is not good. Is that his mom or something? That's the girl who was in the thing with him. It's in her hand. In his memory. Oh. Last what does that mean? Last yeah. Whoa. Oh, okay. Last greenie? Thomas. The last one ever to... Oh, yeah, she knows who he is. My name is also Thomas. <laughs> you gonna go out and dissect that thing all by yourself? I will if I have to. Have the other runners left yet? The other runners quit this morning. Also, ask about where's your vest? Yeah, I'm supposed to get a vest. I think it's time we find out what we're really up against. You're not going back out there alone. Meet me in the woods in half an hour. All right, man. And bring my vest. Yeah. <laughs> Will this be enough? Okay. All right. You got a squad now. Stepping up. Cool. Oh, awesome. What? Oh, okay. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Man, there's something in there. You mean besides a grieve a pancake? Oh, yeah, take the computer out. A camera. Yeah, that red blinky light. Is it still recording? All right, ready? On three. One, two, three. Oh. Yeah, that thing's coming okay. off. Okay. What the hell is that? WCKD, Seven. same as on the crate in the elevator. Oh. This is the same letters we get in our supplies. Who knows where this might lead us? You see what he's trying to do, right? We should punish him. Oh my God, this freaking guy. Put this guy in the pit. The rules are the only thing that have ever held us together. Why now are we questioning that? And kept you in this big box, too. Starting from tomorrow, you're a runner. I mean, it seems like the logical conclusion. Mm hmm. He's the first one to kill a graver, and he came back with clues. Like, why are you so mad, bro? Yeah. Like, just go cook dinner and chill. It's unprecedented circumstances, man. Come on. Yeah, like... At least a little flexibility from you. Yeah. <laughs> this is a modicum. <laughs> Meet me at eighth of the way. Not at all. He must be punished. Please tell me there's like an initiation ayahuasca ceremony. Oh my or gosh, I think you're right. What is this thing? Oh, that's what they've carved all the sequences of the maze. <gasps> then maybe the, the letters and the numbers is the sequence of the maze and how to get out. <gasps> I think, maybe, or not. I don't know. No, you're right. What do you mean, all of it? I thought you were still mapping it. There's nothing left to map. <laughs> Oh. Why haven't you told anyone this? It was Albie's call. People needed to believe we had a chance of getting out. But maybe now... We do? We have a real chance. Printed on the walls. Sections one through eight. When the maze changes, it opens up a new section. The pattern always stays the same. Okay. And that one's from seven. What's so special about seven? Last night when you killed that griever, section seven was open. Tomorrow you and I are going to take a closer look. Yeah, with okay. Seth Meyers. Girls are awesome. <laughs> Girls are awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. So one more of those things. I'm, oh. Go away. <laughs> I don't think she likes us very much. What do you want? Hey, look, we just want to talk. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, hey. We got hella rocks up there. Yeah, like where'd she get all those rocks? Okay, I'm going to come up, okay? <laughs> mm. Just me. He's going to explode. Yeah, <laughs> stay back, buddy. There's nothing this green bean can't do. <laughs> Where am I? This is all normal, okay? We've we've all been through this. Now your name, that'll come back to you in a couple of days. It's like the one thing that's... Teresa. <gasps> yeah, just like she remembered you. She got it quick. 
Girls mature faster. <laughs> you sure you don't remember anything else? I remember water, feeling like I was drowning. These faces staring at me. You remember that too, Thomas. Woman's voice saying the same thing over and over. Wicked is good. Wicked. Wicked is good? <laughs> She's from Boston. She's just trying to explain the <laughs> slang. <laughs> Wicked is good. You were there. There we go. These were in my pocket when I came up. It's the T virus. Wicked is good. Maybe it's an antidote. Here for a reason. For when you get stung. We don't even know what this stuff is. We don't know who sent it, or why it came up here with you. I mean, for all we know, this thing could kill it. Well, I mean, look at him. How could this possibly make it any worse? <laughs> don't accidentally Arm. prick yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. oh my God! You better stab him quick. <laughs> Oh my god, hurry oh, up! Jesus. Goodness oh, gracious. There you go. Oh, what you got there? Oh, that came out pretty damn thing. Oh. That's what he's been carving the whole time. It's for my parents. You remember your parents? Come on, mean, I know I must have them. It could be a test tube, baby. Chuck, why would you give this to me? I can't remember them anyway. You're my best friend. But maybe if you find a way, you can give it to them for me. This kid's a good actor. I yep. like Chuck a lot. Yeah, me too. I want you to give that to them yourself. When we get out of here. We're going to get out of here. All of us. I promise. Oh, buddy. Big day, Greeny. Sure you don't want to sit this one out? <laughs> give me <laughs> a here. Right. Oh, he got a vest. The vest? Where, where, where did the vest come from? How was it not a big event? How did we not have a vest event? There's a whole deleted scene My where they God. build the vest. Uh, they pour some kind of molten leather into a, a you know a big old mold. I am upset. That would have been maybe one of the best scenes. I know. It's okay. Maybe it'll be a flashback in part two. <laughs> four section four. All right, this is looking cool. Section five. five. Okay. We know numbers. We need to get Sex. to seven. All right. Z1. Strange. What? Seven's not supposed to be open for another week. Someone's updated the algorithm. What? Whoa. Hey. Oh, it's like activating. Geiger counter on the I think it's showing us the way. Like, it's way back home to charge. <laughs> it must return to the charging dock. Okay. Yeesh. Hey, WC whatever it was up there. It's a loading hanger or something, it said. It's just another dead end. No. How about that? Oh my god, is the hanger gonna move now? Whoa. Cool. So do you have to kill all the grievers and collect all eight? Dang. Okay. Who's going in the hole? Grievers. What the? the fudge? Oh, it's scanning. It's going to be like, no, but maybe because they have that thing. Give me the whip. I'll throw you the idol. Okay. Oh. Okay. Seven is now closing. Go, go! Wowie. Yeesh. Ooh, no. No. Uh-uh. Oh, no. Whoa. Whoa. Nice job. Whoa. What Run the left or right? Yes, good. There. Okay. Whoa. Wait, this is like breaking up concrete, which like this this doesn't happen all the time. No, they're gonna have to completely redraw their map now. Whoa. It, uh, oh no. my god, not in oh there, god. isn't that? No, no this is what terrible. Oh. No, thank you. Okay, 
Are we done yet? I remember you. You're always their favorite, Thomas. Why did you do this? Why did you come here? What? Who are they? What? Expound. Yeah. Come on, man. Hey, what's, what's going on? It's the doors, they aren't closing. Oh, oh no. now they want y'all to go out there. They're trying to sh shake stuff up. Oh, or that means all the grievers can get in now. Yeah. If they come out at night. The grievers come out at night. Uh. The grievers come out at night. Oh. Oh, snap. Okay. New entrance. Multiple. Huh, huh. All right, now y'all are sitting ducks. If they can come from every sector, you got to fight them off. What? Oh, my God. Y'all better hurry. Come on now. Teresa, uh, come on. Teresa can stop them. Oh, man. Oh! Oh, see you later, buddy. Go, go, go! Oh, yeah. Slack yourself in the old cage. Keepers. Kelly! Let me in, let me in! Oh, <gasps> oh. oh. Oh my Jeez. goodness. Ooh. I would start lighting stuff on fire and see if that works. Burn the place to the ground. Yeah. Whoa. Holy tamale. Oh my god. You gotta throw a Whoa. fire stick in its mouth. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Molotov it. That's right, Teresa. You got great ideas, me and you, girl. Girls get it done. That's what I'm talking about. Light some stuff on fire. <laughs> Help me! Get behind me! Get the fuck! Oh my gosh, it's like also a scorpion. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's like a vinegar. Oh, good job. They stuck it with stuff. What the? Oh. I mean, it was bound to happen. No, oh, no, Chuck. not Chuck. Not Chuck. Not, not Chuck. Chuck. Anyone but Chuck. You better get him back. Somebody stab that piece of metal with something else. Come on, y'all. Yeah, yeah, oh. get it, Abby. What's he going to do? Boy. Yeah, pull that cord. Come on, bro. Yes. Come yes. on. Yes. Yes. Kill that hunk of metal. Yeah. Yeah. I feel the rage. Thanks, Abby. What? Whoa, no! Oh, no! no! You just saved him! Oh, my goodness. Gally. Oh, my yep. God. This freaking guy. Yep. He's one of them. What a who? He's one of them, and they sent him here to destroy everything. Uh, this is your fault. Hey, back up, back up. What happened before you got here? Maybe he's right. Thomas? Stab yourself with it. I need to remember, Teresa. What it, What are you gonna do to remember? Thomas! What? Hey, what Thomas. Hey. <laughs> That's gotta bring up some weird feelings. Oh boy. Who put us? No, we don't know. Are they all actually there, or is it a simulation? Why are we doing this? Excellent, Thomas. Come oh. Is that Patricia Arquette? Wicked is good. It's good. How could this be my fault? I saw you! I can't keep watching that guy. Did he program this whole thing? Gally's taking control. He said we had a choice. Either join him or get banished to sundown with you. Excellent. Yeah. It's not a prison. It's a test. It all started when we were kids. They'd give us these challenges. They were experimenting on us. Ooh. The people who put you here, I worked with them. The entire time you've been here, I, I was on the other side of it. That is so grim. Why would they send us up if we were with them? It doesn't matter. Because the people we were before the maze, they don't even exist anymore. These creators took care of that. And you must have done something to make them put you in here. You went into the maze and you found a way out. Yeah, but if I hadn't, Albie would still be alive. Sacrifice. Shit happens, man. 
But I know that if he were here, he would be telling you the exact same thing. Pick your ass up and finish what you started. Oh, Albie's here in spirit. What if Thomas is right? Maybe he can lead us home. We are home. I'd love it here. You really think banishing us is going to solve anything? This isn't a banishing. It's an offering. What? What are you? Oh my god. Look at our glade. This is the only way. And when the Grievers get what they came here for. <gasps> oh, we killed Galley now. <laughs> Looking like Samwise Gamgee over there. Do you hear me? I said tie him up. I mean. All right, guys, step up. Yeah. yeah there we go. Good, Nut good, punch. good. Good. Yeah. Nut kick. Get him. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> get over here, Samwise. <laughs> come on, Chuck. You don't have to come with us, but we are leaving. Anyone else who wants to come, that's your last chance. Just trying to scare you. No, I'm right? not trying to scare you. You're already scared. All right, I'm scared. You have to be crazy not to be scared. Just come with us. Good luck against the Grievers. Yeesh. All right, you made your choice. You take this, Chuck. Stay behind us. We get out now, or we die trying. Get rich or die trying. All right. <laughs> For Green Bean! <laughs> Ooh, it's Ooh. all spooky and scary. How Ooh. do you fight it? Yes. Nice job, guys. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my God. Somebody stab it in the eye. Stab it in the mouth. Yeah. Yeah. Get its mouth. Come out. Oh stab it no, soft no, no, no. Under no. bits. Yes. No, Chuck. Chuck. Oh my god! Chuck. Oh my god, get it! Please get it! <laughs> Whoa! Oh no! Oh jeez! Oh no! Come nice. on! In the pit! Yes! Oh no! Oh no! This is too much! <laughs> Smart. Uh, Six is what makes. What's the sequence? Uh, One, five, two, six, four. Here we go. Whoa. Oh, oh my no. God! No! 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 Uh, no! Yell that last number out. Yes. Nice stab. What? Oh no. Oh, poor oh. guy. Keep holding! Almost there, come on! Complete. Oh my goodness. Ah, ah. Oh, bye bye, scary, spooky oh, spider. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. yeah, there it goes. One in the mouth. Oh, oh, whoa. Whoa. Gooey. Uh, well, now we're just underground walking through, like, to a concert. I feel like that's what it looks like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. They'll be out in SoFi Stadium in just a second. <laughs> For the Eras tour. <gasps> we remember those lights from his dream. We do. <laughs> Seriously? Uh, yep. Very clearly the exit. Love that. Uh, oh, no. But the Grievers didn't get inside. Right. What happened? <gasps> what if it was Thomas and Teresa killed them all and then put themselves in the maze? Yeah, maybe. I gotta imagine Thomas was like, this is wrong, we shouldn't do this, and then yeah. they put him in or something. My name is Dr. Ava Page. I'm director of operations of the World Catastrophe Kill Zone Department. What? If you're watching this, that means you've successfully completed the maze trials. I wish I could be there in person to congratulate you. Oh my. It was all done for a reason, but the sun has scorched our world. Whoa. Billions of lives lost to fire, famine, suffering on a global scale. Global warming, this movie's woke! <laughs> what came after was worse. 
We called it the flare. Oh no. A deadly virus that attacks the brain. Ooh. It is violent, unpredictable. Oh yeah. In time, a new generation emerged that could survive the virus. Suddenly, there was a reason to hope for a cure. Oh, they're all those. The young would have to be tested, all in an effort to understand what makes them different. <laughs> you may not realize it, but you're very important. You're all the special. Unfortunately, your trials have only just begun. As you'll no doubt soon discover, not everyone agrees with our methods. It may be too late for us. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> Remember. She's going to get shot right on camera. <gasps> Wicked is good. Oh. Cold. That was 45 minutes ago. <laughs> What are we supposed to do now? Get out. Go outside? Oh, God. They got to walk in the scorched earth. Let's get out of here. Okay. No. Oh, Whoa, yeah, there he goes. There buddy. he is. Gally? Don't. He's been stung. We can't leave. No, there's no escape from this place. Has he been out there? Has he seen the world as it is? I belong to the maze. Just put that thing on. What's Chuck thinking? We all do. Oh. Oh, no. no. Ooh, damn. Oh. That was a good fake out. Thomas. Oh, damn oh, it. He no. Not oh, Chuck. No. Yeah. yeah. Take his little carving. No, Chuck, you're going to get to them yourself. Remember, I told you that. You're going to die an old woman warm in your bed. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, where did Chuck go? I've never seen him before. He's good. Yeah. Whoa. The outside world. Who are these people coming in? Legit bad about that. Whoa. Okay. Into the sand. On the outside of the building, I feel like it said wicked. Did it? <laughs> It's safe now. What is going on? Was that their their acronym WCKD? Yes. Wicked. Are they saying that their organization is, is good? good? Wicked. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Oh my God. Did that say wicked shelter. Oh, she's still. Well. Oh my God. I think it's safe to say the maze trials were a complete success. Uh. Thomas continues to surprise and impress. Love that guy. So let's move forward. It's time now to begin phase two. What? What is that? What does that mean? What is the sequel called? What? Grim World. Were all those scientists faking dead? Because that means they had to fake dead for a long time. <laughs> they all had to rig each other up with squibs. Yeah, and like <laughs> get fake Get a bunch blood. of blank firing guns. What in the tamale? Wreck their own lab. Exactly. Yeah. Break everything up. Okay. Well, this has just left me with a, a lot of questions, more questions. What do you mean? Yeah, It's I all mean, wrapped up here, Tara. <laughs> It's not. James Dashner only wrote one novel. <laughs> I assume. I know that's not true. I'm going to say I did not read this book. Okay. <laughs> I had no idea what was going on. I thought at first maybe I did. I did not. Um, this was intense. Yes. I really liked it. Yeah. Galley was a real pain in the ass, uh, which, yeah, I get it. He was our, like, he was playing playing the role, but um, yeah, I still have a lot of questions that um, went unanswered. But I do think it's cool at the end that you're like, oh, see, I was like, I was this. So they are kind of like clones, but not clones. They're experiments, and they're the only ones who can survive the virus. I guess I don't know. Patricia Clarkson, that's uh, her that's name, her. not Patricia yeah, Arquette. Might the, be. I got half John, of it right. He messed up. He messed up. Okay, give us give us the juice, John. What'd you think? <laughs> I enjoyed it overall. I mean, yeah, it's definitely one of those movies that clearly 
is setting up for much more uh, lore and many more twists yeah. and turns to come. So, like, yeah, it's you know, it ends fully on a note of like, oh, we've just scraped the iceberg. Um, but yeah. for the immediacy of what it was, I was always intrigued and I was always kind of gripped by it. I mean, like, you know, you have this very compelling central mystery of like, what's in the freaking maze? You know, like, what's yeah. what's going on out there? What does this all mean? And so, I think a movie like this, in certain ways, uh, benefits greatly off that sense of mystery. Uh, yeah, and certainly by the end, they do give you more mystery to look forward to. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's one of those things where sort of like once you're out, you're like, oh, okay, yeah. So, so the monsters were out there, and then we just kind of had to find the right, uh, you know, sequence of uh, MacGuffins and things, and, yeah. uh, and then we're able to break it. Like it's it's more linear and straightforward than it presents itself to be, which is yeah, like it was going to be like a bait and switch. Like you yeah. thought it was going to have like more of a like tricky reveal. I thought it was going to blow my mind or something. Yeah, and, and like it's cool. Like it's I'm not like griping at it for not having like some like amazing unexpected twist. Right. Um. But yeah, I mean, like knowing again the lane that this originates from. And knowing that a lot of those stories tend to be some kind of dystopian, apocalyptic society. Maybe there's an ecological angle. Like, you know, I mean, all that stuff is kind of fun and interesting as a reveal. Like, oh, the earth has been scorched and we got to, you know, run some Test, weirdo like, test on these yeah. kids. Like, it's it begs a lot of questions in terms of like, okay, so this is like a, a shelter thing, but they're running this game. And it seems like part of the game is carnage <laughs> and so like yeah it, it leaves you with questions certainly which again is most likely by design it's one of those things where i find myself wondering how the sequels will play out and if they will deliver on getting more interesting versus versus like you know, kind it, of laying groundwork right now or will it plummet like will, will it, it fall into being like okay like here's a dystopian sci-fi thing of like a bunch of young people leading a resistance that i've you know kind of seen a lot seen, of times before yeah that we've seen before yes yeah, so like having the maze and having you know the r isolation of like we're in the glade and like you know we can stay here everything's fine or we can go out into this crazy unknown turf and uh, and so without that, you know, I'm sure they'll come up with something else. I'm sure that there's a reason why it's a popular series. Yeah. But, but yeah, it, it kind of, you know, runs its course for the maze itself. And uh, I don't know, like like part of me maybe wish that we could have seen some of the real like unknowns of the maze. Yeah. Like I kind of thought, right, with the number that was on the thing that or mixed with like the maze numbers, which, yes, that came in at the end, which we assumed. But I kind of thought, like, maybe it would be, like, a reveal, like, oh, the way for us to get out, the secret is, like, us. Is, like, uh, us. Like, the people that they would have had, I don't know, especially with Thomas and Teresa, like, remembering. They're the ones who remembered stuff. They came up at the end. I get that they were working on it, smart, like, we kept you in here. But, um, I don't know. I felt like the there would be, but I know the book's already written, but there would be like a reveal that like, I don't know, that the secret was like in them and they had to like figure figure more out. I don't know. I I I did like, I love the relationship between um him and Chuck and yep. I like that a lot. Uh, I didn't get as sad as I think I maybe would have because it's probably not enough time to really build up his relationship with Chuck, but in the book, I bet you there is, right? Yeah. I would have cried when Chuck died if I was reading <laughs> the book. But for some reason, it didn't, it hit me. Trust me, it did. I just didn't like, it didn't hit me super hard. Like maybe it could have if yeah. there was a little more of a buildup, but um, you got to get to the action. So I get it. Well, yeah. And it's one of those things like very end sort of like bleak world stingers of like oh yeah. and, I, and i thought that maybe there was going to be some kind of greater reveal with galley maybe that he was like the plant all along yeah making sure they don't try that and they leave. don't leave or maybe he knows what's outside and he hasn't let on why like he is so attached to being in the glade but yeah you know, but yeah, it, it mostly, at least here in this execution, reads like, ah, we just need one more, like, you know, heart-crushing sting 
of some sort yeah. to just remind you that uh, you know certain things are just too good for this harsh world, and Chuck is one of them. Yeah, I would have know? liked it if at the end, if he had remembered what was out there and how life was shitty, and he's like it confessing that like it was really hard for him out there and it sucked yeah. and this is why he wants to be here and this is like this is me reimagining the movie and he's <laughs> crying and he's like this is the only family i found is here in this box you yeah, know yeah. and then they're like oh man poor galley he's just a jerk because he had a hard life i don't know something like that yeah it like and I'm sure, I don't know, I don't think we'll get any more sort of expounding on that. And, like, again, it's it's not a, a major complaint of mine, because, again, part of the charm of a movie like this is that you're just thrust into a situation. You yeah. don't know much about anybody. But, yeah, like, for as much as that was, like, without that becoming a moment of greater personal significance, it does feel sort of like one final gotcha, because, you know, I mean... True. I don't know. I thought there could have been some kind of arc or some kind of thing with him where, you know, it's like, oh, I was wrong or, or I followed you guys out. Please, you know, like accept me or something or please yeah, let me come along. True. Like, wait up for me. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Like, th I thought that that. Yeah. That that ending beat could have been more rich in character stuff that would have made it more feel yeah. a little less like a puppy killing <laughs> yeah <laughs> you know to, that's true to make sure that you know thomas becomes that much more hardened next time yeah um, and you know i mean like Teresa certainly interesting presence not much of a character not, that's we really like another about thing ever. that i'm like what the heck like she was just like there and she came with a note and then we didn't really give her any more juice than that yeah, and, and it's, f again, I know the, the counter will probably be like, well, in the sequels, she's going to be a lot more important. Yeah, but, um, but, yeah. You know, it, for the execution here, if I only saw this movie, I would be like, eh, I kind of want to get to know her a little bit better. Yeah. Um, or, you know, establish some kind of connection, you know, because they have the whole thing about, like, we know each other. We used to work yeah. right across from each other. But it's it's only kind of a just one of many details touched upon you that's know? touched upon and left in the like very quickly yeah and it's yeah. like all the maze stuff is is cool the effects are neat like the idea is really cool and i think you know you can't make this like a two and a half hour movie yeah. necessarily but you know it's once you're on the other side of it i think it's that it's like since they already have the whole place mapped out i get the utility of that plot choice but at the same time i'm like we could like learn about I don't know, because like we are, we're doing it through Dylan O'Brien's perspective, but at the same time, I don't know. It's it's pretty straight. I guess that's what I keep coming back to is like for as much as this it's seems like a big complicated linear. puzzle, yeah. it's pretty straightforward. And I think yeah. too, it's like once he goes into the maze and figures it out, you know what to kind of look for, and and you know kills the reaver, uh, griever, and all that stuff. You know that pretty much sets you directly on the path whereas me i'm sitting here going well there are like eight quadrants they all must be different or yeah. are they all or or you know is it just like any one of these could have been the exit you know why is right. it that they found the one it's that thing it's like they found number seven first and number seven is the exit it's what they thought of. i thought they were going to do something like that where it's like oh it's just the next level of the game but it's not the it's exit it's not the exit and spiritually that's true because at the end patricia clarkson's like you know this I, isn't the i end. wish i could tell you this is the end but this is yeah. just the beginning um but you know like we're out into the world now so like yeah. i don't know the the unless they're gonna prison break this and find a way to maneuver them into a new maze into, and this is just oh a future God. that deals with its problems via maze it's just, it's just a scorched earth with multiple mazes on it and they just throw <laughs> children in there they're yeah like good luck yeah, and I thought, you know, the 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 idea of the whole like wicked is good thing, you know, was an interesting mantra to kind of get you thinking about human nature and then by the end you're like, "Oh, it must be that, you know, this organization are the good guys maybe and we shouldn't trust the people who are in rescuing the kids right now." Right. Um, but I don't know, this idea of like I, th I thought that's what it said on the outside was like wicked uh, uh shelter shelter or something yeah. like that and and Guys, <laughs> I, I think well, it's funny the that they went now. with "wicked" as their acronym. Was yeah. it world? It's like world, world catastrophe something. kill zone something or kill kill department. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> they're funny like earmarks to me that do very much again harken to you know 
the fun of a YA novel adaptation because yeah, again, it's like, all wicked about it is good. We got the cool it's terminology and all man. of our different lore that we're gonna set up for you in a you yeah. know. And, uh, you know, it, it, for an immediate, I think I enjoyed the immediate experience of this quite a bit. And I enjoyed the movie in hindsight once it was concluded. Like, I thought it was pretty good. It was, it was, yeah. it was fun and it was, you know, intriguing. But um, it's going to, you know, like the sequel or whatever is going to have to, like, really kind of set itself apart from various other, like, the world has been destroyed and we're and trying now to we rebuild have to go, it. And you're yeah, the special typical. with the cure. You know, yeah. It, like, it. It's that I think is like the the f- early parts of the movie have you going like this is really fascinating and I'm not yeah. even thinking about other stories like this and then when you get to the end I'm like now I'm thinking of a lot of other stories like yeah, this. yeah 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 it's yeah. true I feel like the writer was like he was thinking about a phrase that people would use after they read his book and it's everybody who has the book and they're like you know that that's what they're doing and like yeah i'm like oh that's probably their inside thing like i'm surprised in 2014 i didn't see like teenagers walking around with t-shirts to say wicked is good yeah. but then i might have been like you mean the musical or <laughs> you know might have been confusing yeah or just you know boston slang again anyway i give wicked it means good it means good and i'll give it i'll give it a us uh, seven out of ten what do you give it john lay oh, yeah. down uh, 6.5 maybe because yeah we're, we're probably in the same spot i was gonna i was gonna go out of five and say like you know three three and a half like it's pretty good yeah it's pretty good like pretty. i thought it was well assembled i yeah, thought it was really i agree yeah like i thought the performers all did a really nice job i thought the way they you know established the world of their camp was really nice. Um, I, I liked a lot of the details of how they were living and how they shot a lot of this, the intensity and just the way they captured a lot of the effects and a lot of the action sequences felt appropriately yeah. thrilling and harrowing and intense and whatnot. And again, in you know, when you're still deep in the mystery, I was really intrigued by that stuff. So I think like, you know, behind the camera there was a lot of good work going yeah, on. Yeah, that's true. Um and then yeah, you know, as a as an actual story, you know. This is all right, pretty good. Yeah, you know, I think fun. it's like I always think in my head I go to story, but then I was like, oh man, but those scenes with the spiders, like John's remember, <laughs> like remembering it more than me. But now I'm like, I'm in it, and I'm like, those were pretty dope. Those were awesome. And I'm like, what are those things? Like, yeah, what, exactly. did you guys make these for these trials, or this is this part of the I- immunity yeah. thing? Like, you know, did you like capture a few, mod them out, and then you know, because this seems like it was all because of of you know, global warming, weather catastrophes. Yeah. So what accounts for these creatures? Are they purely yours? Is there something else at work there? Yeah. Again, I'm sure we'll find out in a sequel. But we want to um, know now. But yeah, there are ways in which this could have felt like a more well-rounded movie experience on its own. I yeah, guess. like yeah. a more well-rounded story. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Well, but, you know. we did it. We watched it. We liked it. Yeah. We'll probably watch. I would be happy you guys to should watch comment the next one yeah. and let us know if we should watch the next one. I would also be happy to watch the next one. Yeah. I mean, we should just we should just do it and then be like, we'll 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 all watch it together. We'll all decide. But you guys should also be like, you should watch the next one. But don't do <laughs> any spoilers in case we are going to. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, what else do I say in closing, John? <laughs> I want to re- see you react to all the things I just told you about. <laughs> um, I think we're good. I think you want to shout out a patron really quick before yeah. we get out of here? Let's do that thing. Let's do it. Anissa Oliva. Mm. There's only one girl in the movie, but now you're the second girl. Well, Tara's here too, but yeah, you, are, here you too. are one of the few girls involved with the Maze Runner experience today. And if we were caught in the maze, I would absolutely want you on our team because totally. you are a caring person, but you're also a person who knows your way around, you know, like health and medicine type things. Oh. And also, you're just the kind of person who is tenacious, you know? If we had this to figure good. the maze out, yeah. I feel like you would keep us on track. You that would, would keep be us good. feeling good, morale high. Yeah, and, and she'd also be able to heal wounds or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. And if we found out later that you were secretly involved with, you know, like experimenting on us and oh. stuff, like I would I would be willing to give you the benefit of the doubt and still I would accept just kill you. you. 
sh- I mean, also valid. I'm going to have to protect you from Terra. And that's also what this shout out is for, is just to let you know, you know, you know that like, uh, you should watch your back, too. It's like, man, you were in there. You were doing experiments with these spiders in the maze. I'm like, I'm not. I know. Nope, no, nope, that's some BS. Like, you got to go, that you is. know. So whatever, I guess when we We're see pushing each other, you out into the maze now, yeah. Anissa. But keep your pledge on file because that's keep what it. really this is all Definitely about. Definitely keep it. And if we funding. ever meet in person... He's your buddy, and I guess maybe I'm not. But if your we watch, an, if we watch another movie though, and like we do another shout out ways from now, like it might be a different story with you and me. So you know, then we could be friends again. So you got to keep your patronage, so like we can see where our relationship goes, friendship wise. You know, I like that idea. Yeah, that's a good idea, right? Maybe you'll come out of the uh, the other side as friends. Yeah, and you'll you never both know. Kill me. Ooh, the other side of the rainbow. Boom. Appreciate you. We'll see you there. Love you, Nisa. Love you. Bye. Peace.